fashionable choice of Sophie, Countess of Wessex, at the official maritime engagement. Sophie, Countess of Wessex represented His Majesty the King at the most prestigious passing out parade of the year at Britannia Royal Naval College. The Countess took the salute as the future generation of naval officers completed months of tough training. For the special event, Sophie's outfit choices represented her down-to-earth and relatable nature, opting to rewear a selection of clothes and jewelry she's worn before, including her wedding earrings. Sophie, Countess of Wessex took on another important duty for the royal family earlier in the week, representing King Charles at an important naval ceremony. For the event, Sophie chose to reuse many fashion favorites we've seen before, including her black and white pearl wedding earrings, designed by Prince Edward. In other royal news, Dancing King Sweet Charles dances the stresses away with Holocaust survivors and members of the Jewish community. Sophie, Countess of Wessex continues proving herself a valuable asset to the royal family, stepping up to represent the king at an important parade for naval officers. Sophie took the salute as over 200 future naval leaders took part in their passing out parade. She and Edward recently hit a new milestone in representing the royal family for the first time at the Royal Variety Gala, a step many saw as a sign that the pair are becoming more important than ever before to the institution. For the significant event at the Britannia Royal Naval College, Sophie wore a Max Mara navy blue coat and a pair of LK Bennett Bell knee-high boots which she has worn before. The Countess also rewore a Philip Tracy hat and the HMS Daring brooch. The HMS Daring is a ship of which Sophie is the sponsor. Finishing off her chic look, Sophie wore the black and white pearl earrings she wore for her wedding. Prince Edward designed these touching earrings for his wife, and Sophie's decision to wear such sentimental favorites has fans praising her. Rewearing so many classic pieces, fans online have called Sophie down to earth and many are wanting her to be given a new title. One wrote, Sophie rocks it again. How elegant. And I just love those earrings. Another added, Sophie is a classy lady and I love that she reworks older hats. Another comment celebrated her dedication to reworking old pieces, and added that they'd love to see her made the Duchess of Edinburgh. Sophie also delivered a rousing speech to the future naval officers during her visit. She said, This is a big moment in your lives, the moment when you become serving officers in His Majesty's Navy, the moment when you leave all the hard training behind you and take up the mantle of responsibility. Until now you have been looking to others to guide you and show you the way. From now on, it is you who will be leading others. Leading, and leading well, takes skill. Officers who stand out are those who put the men and women with whom they serve first and in doing so seem to foster bonds of loyalty, credibility and respect. A new generation of naval officers is born today. I hope you will be proud of what you have achieved and what you will go on to achieve.